We are on to council reports. Bryn, any reports to share? Uh, I don't. The next municipal infrastructure committee meeting will be next week. We have yet to develop um, the final agenda. So if anybody has topics they would like us to cover, um, please send them my way. I'm happy to address them um, in our next meeting. And um, attended the uh, Shop Winooski this past Thursday, and it was an excellent event. It was great to see everyone out and uh, run into some fellow counselors down there. So. Um, a great event and, and happy to see, uh, happy to see all the work that went into it and all the vendors and, um, folks Winooski out there. Thank you. Jim. Thank you. Um, so I have attended, uh, the housing commission meeting last month, um, where we looked at, uh, the update that was provided to council, just to have a debrief on that. We had some public discussion at council and again at the commission meeting around some housing quality issues. Uh, and also talked about the um, potential uses for our funding in housing if that's the direction that occurs. Um, we looked at some of the uh, ideas for using that funding in a discreet way. Um, the commission was in particular interested in uh, the chapter of my life and I'll be in Aruba um, as of October 1st next year so it's been a great experience to uh, represent our city locally and at the state level and um, I hope to keep in touch with all of you thanks Hal for all of your service I'm glad we have a couple more months to keep working together well-deserved retirement plans that sound wonderful to me um, I'm yeah, Mike, council updates. Good evening, everybody. I have nothing to report today. Thank you. Um, the only thing I will share is Jim and some and staff and I met with the Gov HR, the the recruiter for the city manager role, to finalize next steps and timeline. Um, 
That is pretty much final. Going to be doing some recruitment from our previous search committee, and I should be able to bring a formal update to our next meeting to share with you all where we're at there and when we'll kick that off and what you can expect for your time commitments for potential candidate interviews. With that, I will turn it to Wendy for our city updates. Okay, thank you, Mayor. I uh, want to let uh, potential candidates for the city council positions know uh, that they can pick up petitions at the clerk's office um, or online. Now for that petition, you need 30 signatures. It's best to get a few more in case that uh, some are not valid and they're due to the clerk by Monday, January 24th. Uh, the registration for winter recreation programs has started, so now's the time to register. And Heather informed me that the city has been awarded a municipal planning grant to develop a housing equity plan, which is great news. And that plan will build on the housing findings in the equity audit report, which is uh, scheduled to be complete in the next couple of months. And just a reminder that the parking ban is in effect for all of downtown through March. And for the remainder of the city, bans are as needed. And you can tell when one is active by the flashing lights at the entrances to town or to the city rather. And you can also sign up for alerts on Nixle, uh, which helps. And I understand from the folks who um, gave out the reminders that people are already complying and they complied earlier this year than they have in previous years, which is great. So thank you very much to the public. And that's all I have. Thank you.